What will they ask of her? Can she give it? Go to them, Senwa. They will tell <laughs> tell us how to kill a giant. You know what that means, do you, Senwa? No more sacrifices. Once again, she is leaving the sun, leaving the world, plunging into the unknown places which no light touches. She has always been afraid of the dark, a deep, still silence that blinds her eyes till she thinks she will never see again. But there is a thread this time. It connects her to the ones above. She has promises to keep. She will not let them down. Where are we going, Senora? I have a bad feeling about this. I don't like <clears throat> this. What were they looking for? The hidden part. What is this place? Just a cave. She knows what she's doing. It's a trick. Trust yourself, Samuel. Still, nothing special. It was a trick. It's getting smaller. Where is it taking her? Everything you have done has brought you here. To nothing. Nowhere. Maybe your father was right. Maybe you are nothing. Maybe you will die here. Just like the others. No one will remember you. <gasps> you will be nothing. Be careful with your torch. <gasps> Don't let the torch die. If the light goes out, you will be lost here forever. Look. What? A light. Where is it? A light at the end of the darkness. They're coming back. They're here. Look at the light. <laughs> the scalds speak of how Grettir, now an outlaw, took rest on the island of Haramsoy with a man called Audun. Grettir saw a great yellow glow like a fire rising from the ground. Ardun told him it was coming from the burial mound of Carr the Old, who ever since he died had haunted the island, and warned him to stay away.
something different. Go towards it. A doorway? Is it? Colors shifting, moving, changing. <sighs> and yet more darkness. More rock. This is a different kind of light. What else can you do but trust it? She doesn't have a choice. Sometimes she needs the light. 
But sometimes she needs the darkness. Gretier wanted the sword that was buried in Carr's how and would not be deterred from seeking it. He broke the mound open and started digging until he reached the timber props. By this time it was night. Audun warned him again not to continue, but Gretier threw down a rope and went inside the mound. No light penetrated it, and it reeked of death. But he persisted in exploring. The hidden folk. They made this. Something is coming. Something is coming. 
feeling something is coming. Something doesn't feel right here. Everything you regret, your shame, your pain. Turn your face to them and open your eyes. You can only hide for so long, and then you must take the plunge. Follow it. A path of light. Why do you have to go there? <laughs> <laughs>
This can't be right. It's the only way. She has to go through it. Go through it. Ah! 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 It's okay. Something needs to be done. What is this place? Sky. Beautiful. How is it possible? Too deep for this kind of beauty. What is that? Who is that? It needs your help. They need our help to cross. we get to it she doesn't she doesn't know <gasps> you need to know you need to find out it's another test don't trust it you need to prove yourself she needs to prove herself she needs to show them that she is the way is blocked but it can be changed change the world and make your path She can't give it to them. You will be trapped here forever. You won't be able to see. Now she is trapped. Stupid. Stupid. You need a torch. You can't do anything without your torch. Trapped here now forever. Think. Forever. There must be a way through. You want to see her? Huh? Yes, there. A path. You can do this in your wisdom. Beyond. 
she has to find what is hidden. We need to get to the other side, change the rock back, make it disappear. does. The light does as well. Let's go to the cavern. This, this is where we need to go. We need to find our path into it's getting dark. So dark. We are going into the darkness again. No. I don't want to go into the darkness again. I want to go into the darkness no, either. No, no, no. no. Stay again. here. Stay here in the light eyes to see what might be. You have made your way. Let yourself be guided this by us. This is our reward. <sighs> A light. In the dark. A light in the dark. So beautiful. I can see again. Moving. Guiding you through the dark. I can breathe again. Still dark. Listen. There is more than... The darkness held a question. Are you strong enough? She doesn't know the answer yet. But they will tear it from her mouth. Where did he go? 
through. <laughs> I like it. Can we tell? There is no way <laughs> back. Just take us uh, another. <laughs> They led you here. They betrayed you. They brought you to die. You cannot trust them. Are they trying to destroy you? Luring you in. Keeping you here. Be careful. <laughs> Did the lunch? <laughs> It's nothing. So cold. It's nothing. Don't think about it. Don't listen. Wait. Are they here? Then we'll meet your destiny. Can you feel them? Within the depths. The cave is singing to you. It's guiding you. The listen. walls are singing to you. They know, are they? No. You can't. Those 
creatures are down here with you. They need help. This is all I have. Senua, you can't. You can't do it. She is thinking about it. No, Senua. Protect us. You need that sword. Senua, no. You have to be able to fight. It's all you have. She is ignoring us. Senua, listen to us. Senua, no. We know what to do. We are protecting you. Sacrifices must have meaning. She has given away that which makes her strong. Her protector. Her avenger. The thing she grips tight when darkness overwhelms her. What is a warrior without her sword? What is she now? She must forge a new path. Defenseless against the dead ones. The armor has fallen away. Senua, it's dark. It's too dark. You have a purpose here. Stay in the light. You can't see anything without the light.
Go. Go, 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 go. I hate it here. It's too terrifying. Sometimes she feels the darkness will never end. Or worse. It will get deeper and darker until she is crushed under it. Her last breath floating up to the sky she will never see again. But it is over. There is a shift, an invitation. They draw her onwards, just out of reach, but there. She is close now. seeking car's loom buried in the grave mound he went to leave but before he could reach the rope something grabbed him from behind and Grettir realized the mound dweller would not let his treasure go the two fought ferociously until Grettir got the advantage and chopped off the revenant's head but car's loom would prove his undoing fated to be the sword that killed him This is the last test. You can see. This is the last trial. The hidden folk are here. They have tested us so long. And now they have brought you to them. she was doing but now now look at her look at her no. she knows how to look at it there is no way they could fail she knows how to find a new way you were worried she understands their world we are ready Sen. You are ready. We have showed them everything we are. Every fragment. 
Every skull. We have nothing left. She can see herself. All the other selves. Us. We. She is thinking in all the pieces. Fragments that helped her. We know all of them. All the signs. We can see them clearly. All connected. All meaningful. Yes. She remembers how it started. Almost an end. Drowning in the ocean. But we saved her. We saved you. We screamed your name till you heard us. And we fought together. We survived. You were lost in this new land. Broken. You had no hope. Once again, we helped you. We always help you. We helped you find courage. An unbreakable purpose. It started with a promise that holds so much power over you. threads of her mind. She's here to find them. The ones who hide. They will tell her how to defeat the giants. And she will keep her promise. But it's never so simple, is it? Wisdom has a price. There will always be a part of you that changes. A part of you that darkens. And a part of you that dies. I can feel them. I can feel them everywhere. The lost ones. They are watching us. Your voice. 
voices. All the parts of you that are broken. You can be whole. All the grief. All the rage. All the fear. Everything I've seen. Everything I've done. Has led me to this place. We've come so far. Not far enough. Say it. You are ready. Tell them. I am here. Now. What if we get lost forever? What will happen to them? What will happen to you? I will not let them down. She is ready. They know. Go. Who are these around you, Senor? Those you have saved. Those who have led to death. You see things differently from the others. Look, and you will see her. By her name, you will know her. Nothing is born of nothing. In the first days, the air was sweet and fresh. The ground and the sea gave up their bounty. They knew that after all their fighting, they had found somewhere to rest, somewhere to carve out a home. But then Askia screamed her fury. Blotted out the sun. She covered the green with her bitter poison and drowned the hills in bile. Nothing could breathe through her hatred. All their animals choked. Their crops withered in the ground, and the people withered too. The woman had to leave her home and go in search of food. But everywhere there was nothing. Where were their gods now? Turned their backs. The terror of hunger and the thirst drove the people to fury. As is the way of that kind. The weak lost all to the strong. Weakest of all in her arms, still she searched for a haven. But the darkness from the sky reached down. The flesh-eating ones, with the awful hunger that could never be sated, were legion. And death held a Rose, dark and more terrible than those before. She could not let the child live in such a world. So she brought her to a cave where the hidden folk were set to live. Hoping they would take her child and raise her free from care. Free from the darkness. 
she had nothing to feed her now, but her rage and despair. She made a deal. I will give myself to you, Askia, if you will give me the power to triumph in this world you have created. Take my life and give me your death. See 
see how small you are. Do you see how the pitiless world stamps you down? raw and bleeding, rootless, selfless. All the names that were lost, she will fight and hold. She knows her name now. Ingun. She knows her. You know her name. You understand her. Not a monster after all. She is lost in her rage. You have found what you sought. I know what they were trying to show me. I know Il Tiger's true name now. Ink. Ingun. Names have power. True names, they cut to our hearts. To know the true name of something is to command it. Bring her here. Can we call to her? Like the Draga did. She will kill you. The Draga were aping the costumes of the living, acting out what they did before they turned. A grotesque parody of the blowed ones held in that sacred place. Sacrifices to Freya. We can call to her too. Yes. And yes, she will come. But she will kill you. Just like she has so many of us. Then what? She can never be reached. We need to find a place. Where you can meet her face to face and see the world through her see eyes. Our world. And there are ways of opening up the door into another space. Another place. Fire and rage. The veil. And hides the veridit as they whisper. It us. The veil. Through which you can sometimes catch a glimpse. She understands. There are ways to tear that open. She knows. Pass in. It won't be the first time. She's suffering. Wrecked with grief, I saw it. Even folk showed her. A ritual. A ritual. A ritual to open up the door. A ritual to heal her pain. Meet her eyes. And speak her name. A ritual. Rituals will change it. They will bring change. They transform. They move and change the world. They uncover what is hidden. Is it safe? Never safe. 
What will you do? How will you know what to do? What happens if we cannot enter into the ritual with you? You may be alone, said one. Without us? Not alone. With her.
Senwa. She is dying. El Toyga, she is. I need to go home. Will your father join us if you tell him what you saw? Yes. He will not run from battle. He will lead us into it. There is more than the sword here. More than he can understand. No more slaves. And no more sacrifices. He is trying you to understand. Is no he? sacrifices. No more cowering in our fortress. We could fight. We have. But not in the way he thinks. No more sacrifices, swear. I never wanted any of that. I just did not believe it was possible to defeat them. And now I see. A ray of her hope. If this is real, no more sacrifices. You have my word. This needs to be for something. Be sure of that. She is exhausting if at sunrise. I will come with you. I know the goal. And he respected me once. I will bear witness to what was done here today. What are we going to do next, sir? 